Hey guys, today I have my first update for the Finish 15 by Halloween challenge. Um, as traditional for my version of this project, I divide my category into five face products, five lip products, and five eye products. Uh, so starting with the face products, apologies for the small child. Um, we have the Avon 3-in-1 foundation, which as you can see I have hit a good chunk of pan on i am sort of working my way around it slowly i feel like this is a bit too dry on my skin at the moment um i think the weather is just is too warm for this it's too um there's a matte version of this out now which i have and i haven't tried and i feel like if this is too dry now i think the matte version is going to be extremely dry um so yeah i can't wait to get that used up and out of my collection the two true match products i'm getting on really well with the um i'm a bit bummed because this is sort of shook up a little bit but i'm getting on really well with the concealer it's kind of around here at the moment um so I think I will probably definitely be able to get this whole thing finished up by Halloween. Same with the foundation. I've been mixing this specifically with the Kat Von D Locket foundation. And I'm all the way down here. Um, so I think if I carry on mixing this with the Kat Von D, I will get a, a good deal of use out of this guy. And then I might mix it with the Too Faced Born This Way foundation. Because I feel like the Born This Way foundation is very similar to the Locket foundation in that it's a very dry texture, very thick and difficult to apply. So I think this will definitely be finished by the end of the project. The Hourglass Trio of Powders. Um, I've used a couple of times. It's, it's... I think what's put me off using these is it's just an extra step. It's just another thing that I have to put on my face that I don't always have time for in the morning. Um, so yeah, I think I just need to sort of push myself and force myself, maybe use it for setting or something. Just try and do something with it. And lastly for face, I have the Pixie Glow Mist, which I actually started using just this week. And I've used this much in a week. Like this was brand new, filled right up to the top. And now I'm that far gone. So I think this will definitely be used up. If I compare this to the other Pixie Mist I'm using. This is just the, the classic base uh, makeup mix, fixing mist. Makeup fixing mist. Um, and I managed to achieve this in two months of infrequent use. So with frequent use, um, I think I could even possibly get this finished up by... The next update okay so maybe not by the next update but definitely before definitely get this finished up within the time period of the project so on to eye products um i don't know what i was thinking picking so many liquid eyeliners um the Soeva one i thought was gonna be done really really quickly because it was so old but it just keeps going it keeps going um it does smudge a bit um like if I'm using, if I'm doing like a cat eye or a wing or whatever, uh, it does wear away in the outer corner. So I do have to touch it up or sometimes it will bleed. Like I said in my intro, it bleeds into the skin and sometimes it will run. Um, so I'm glad I, I didn't purchase this. I will never purchase it again. Um, the tattoo liners, I actually really like them. Um, I haven't necessarily been using this one. <laughs> which is silly. Um, I was using uh, the green version that I have and it's really nice and vibrant and pigmented. Um, but I definitely need to get cracking and use this guy a bit more. And the vinyl one, I actually forgot I put in this project because again, this was one of those projects that I forgot to write down what I was putting into it. Um, but now that I'm fully aware, um, I can crack on with it because I have been using it I've just felt guilty about using it because I was like, oh, this isn't really in my project. I should be using these two, but I really want to use this one. Um, but yeah, so I have had progress on it. I just forgot it was in the project and just felt guilty for using it. Um, and then we have my pencil liner, which I haven't been using. So I've been focusing on my green one in the Curse project. And um, so this has no use on it apart from the, the tip that I broke off 
And lastly, for eyes, we have the brow pencil, which I have used um, a fair bit of. Not a whole lot. Because um, I forgot I had um, an eyebrow pencil in another project that finishes before this one. So I'm working on that one first. But when I do get onto using this one, it'll it'll be gone in an instant. You know how I am with the, these pencil liners. They maybe last two months. So that is it for eye products. The lip products, like I said, this was probably a silly idea for me to do. And I, I continue to believe it was a silly idea. Um, <laughs> but um, I haven't had very much use out of these products. I haven't used the lip liner at all. Um, I've used both Heaven and Sex Pot a couple of times each. I've used Heaven more because um, I find Sex Pot is just very like a blank out on my lips. So I might use Sex Pot more as like a topper um, to these guys, um, which I have used. I've used Erotic more. Um, but uh, <laughs> I haven't used them enough to show any real progress on. So if I focus on them between now and the next update, there might be some progress to share with you. And hopefully I will get some use out of the list here. Thanks, bubs. Thanks. So that is my update for the Finish 15 by Halloween. Um, between making and posting the intros for my last few um, project updates. I did have a little time period of not wearing makeup regularly, which is why I have very little progress and plus, stop it, put it back. Filming with children, never a dull moment. <laughs> I have a basket that's full of like my shower gels. Um, the shower gels broke the shelf in the bathroom that they sat on. The The weight was just too much. So now they sit in a basket in my room. And um, he often plays with them. So yeah. The sooner I can get them back in the bathroom, the better. Um, so like I was saying, I had a period where I wasn't wearing makeup a whole lot. Which is why I don't have a lot of progress on those products. Plus, I didn't have time to write down what the products were in the products. Which didn't really help matters. In the slightest. <laughs> so hopefully between now and the next update I might be able to get some progress done and um, yeah fingers crossed and I will see you guys next time. Thank you so much for watching and bye bye.